Hey crafty family, what up? I want to show you my pocket letter that I've been making. It's for Valentine's Day because I'm making a Valentine's Day pocket letter. Isn't that pretty? Um, it's I did like a mixed media kind of thing. Like I did, um, I put, uh, what do you call it, texture paste. I don't know if you can see it. Back behind there, there's like texture paste. Like on this one, the little diamonds are texture paste. And then I used um, my... Uh, metallic thingies the um they're like the ink of gold the deco arts one metallic lusters that's it <laughs> couldn't find the word for it and I made these little hearts and I put like a crackle medium over top of them so they're like crackling I don't know if the camera is um, focusing I'm losing my words today I can't speak um, but yeah I put vintage pictures of couples on there and so that's my pocket letter okay enough of that <laughs> um, I got happy mail and it's so awesome I got happy mail from Kay Kay Borland who sent me the most amazing happy mail it's awesome and I'll show you the very best thing about it um, that was inside of the happy mail voila my very first dilutions paints I'm so excited and I already opened this to look at it because it's just so yummy and I can't wait to play with it isn't that pretty look at that color Oh, so exciting. I'm so excited. Thank you so much, Kay. You totally made my day, and my toothache doesn't hurt so bad anymore because I got this. <laughs> no, it actually still does hurt. I'm a bit drugged up. I'll just say that. You get me You get me all drugged up. Yay! Because <laughs> that's the only way I can cope because it's just really bad. Um, but anyway, I got the uh, purple one, the crushed grape, and the bubblegum pink, and these are the two that I wanted the most was these two colors. So it's so funny that she gave me these two colors because they're the ones I wanted the most. Um, okay, and then, sorry, I got distracted. Um, I will show you the rest of the stuff that is in the package that she sent me. Bubble wrap! I love bubble wrap because I like to use this stuff for all kinds of things. She sent me these really cool napkins. Um, there, well, there's a lot of Christmas ones. I didn't really look through the whole thing. I just kind of glanced through it. But there's some napkins that are really pretty. Which I'll try to get out all the napkins. And it looks like they're all Christmas. Um, which is cool because I love Christmas napkins. They will be great for next year. But this is great because it's got words on it. And what's cool about this is you can use it as like a whole napkin and put it on something. Or you can cut the words out and use them as like sentiments on things which is awesome and then this one's got like holly berries and like uh, you know pine tree leaves and all that stuff or whatever you call them the branches of pine trees I don't know what they're called I don't know and this one again has got holly berries and stuff and that one's got holly berries this one's cool because it's got like season to be merry and it's got the little flags so you can actually cut out those flags and make like a flag for a pocket letter or something really cute and I like this one this one's really cute it says joy to the world and season's greeting it's got a train cute and I like this one with the birdie the cardinal and this one's really pretty I like this one it's like gold with red little holly berries on it very pretty thank you Kay and then she sent me some stamps, which I'm really excited about. There's these four little stamps, which I love little stamps. They're fun for like when you want to make your own washi or when you're doing um, ATCs or like inchies or like, you know, the little tiles and stuff. These are perfect for those. And then here's these, which one says enjoy the journey and the other one has a suitcase. I love stuff that has travel stuff. I don't have enough of that stuff. That's really cool. And then she sent me bottles that had glitter in it, and they're so cute. One of them broke open, but I'm going to try to get as much of the green glitter back in there as possible. But there's a whole bunch of these tiny little bottles, and they have glitter in them. They're so cute. It's like fairy dust. These are really cute. I like those. Very cute. And then there's a bunch of washi, which I love. And I like this one. It's got numbers on it. And then this one's pink with white polka dots. And glitter love glitter I love the gold glitter um, washi tape I have some but I hoard it so now I won't have to hoard it so much because I love that one whenever I'm doing something I, I tend to use a lot of the gold glitter one 
And she sent me a, um, a lot of little note cards, which these are great to make for journal cards. And look at those little clips on them, aren't they cute? They're so adorable. And yes, we're going to be announcing the giveaway winners, by the way, just letting you know. And look at these. These are bracelets. And they have skulls on them. Aren't they cool? I love them. They're so cute. I love them. They're so cute. And they don't slide off. They're just the right size where if they were just a little bigger, they would slide off because I have tiny wrists. So they don't even like, they're, they don't even have a chance to stretch because they're already big on me. <laughs> but they're cute. I love them. And then there's some little boxes with stickers, which I didn't even look in these. It's got stickers. Aww. It's got Christmas stickers in them. How cute. And I'm imagining this one has Christmas stickers too, but I won't go through all of them. What's this? <gasps> Ooh, I seen these too. These are, um, these are ba like background type of stamps, but it says mini molding mat. I guess these are like, are these for like clay? Oh yeah, these are mostly for putting patterns in clay, which I'm happy about too, because I would like to do that as well. But you can use these obviously as stamps, um, which I thought they were really cool patterns. Very cool. And then there was this one. And I like this one with all the different wavy lines. That's going to be fun for clay too. And for making texture on anything really. I love that. Thank you so much because these are really cool. And then this one was adorable. Oh my goodness. It's got a little sewing. Um, it's got a little old sewing machine and scissors and a thimble and stuff. And I'm just about to learn how to sew a little bit more. So that's going to be really cool to have. It's kind of ironic. Ooh, more stickers in a box. And then she made me these tiles, which are absolutely gorgeous. She did such a good job. You could see like so many layers in the background of that one. I hope it's focusing. And then there's this one here. And I have that washi tape. I could tell that's washi only because I have it. But if I didn't know it was washi, I wouldn't know. But I have that same washi tape. That's so funny. But I absolutely love these. They're so pretty. She put so many layers on these. And especially this one. It really shows that there's a lot of layers on there. I love that. So cute. And then there is these two adorable binder clips. I've never seen binder clips before with little happy faces on them. So I was like, I got such a kick out of these. Aren't they cute? I love them. And then last but not least, she sent me, and what's funny about this is my mom and dad, my dad mostly, he owned a hardware store. My mom worked there. She basically worked the counter and she worked in his office and stuff years and years and years and years ago when I was little. And she had this exact ink pad. And she used to let me take like the date stamp and like play with it. But it's literally a Carter's ink pad. Just to like, like an old vintage ink pad. And I wonder if I'm going to open it because it's already got like a, a split in the plastic. Because I want to see if it still has ink in it. But yeah, my mom had one of these. And it just brought back memories. Oh, it's, it's not full. Oh, it's... Oh, you put your own ink in it. Oh, cool. That's really cool, though, because I have um, a lot of reinkers, so I can make, like, my own custom color. Oh, that's pretty cool. But she had a black ink pad that looked just like this. And, you know, she used to use, like, her date stamp or her paid stamp or whatever. But that's really cool. I love this. It just brings back memories. It's so funny. And then there is her note, which she sent to me. Um, and that's it. So thank you Kay so much because I love all this stuff. It's so neat, especially this ink pad. She even said in her note I, that she knew I'd probably get a kick out of it. And she is right because I definitely think this is so awesome. Um, and I definitely, oh my God, I cannot wait to play with these. Dilutions paints, I'm so excited. So thank you so much. I mean, it's just, you spoiled me. This is such an amazing package. It's got a lot of really fun stuff in it to play with. Um, also, we are going to do the giveaway announcement. I um, picked a couple people out of a hat. Well, not exactly a hat. It was a Tupperware bowl type of thing. Hold on. I'm going to do that, but before I do that, I had some gold, um, I don't remember what it was. I think it was like, 
watered down um, Inca gold or something in this thing and it dried up because these containers, even though they seal, they seem to seal pretty well. They're not airtight, I guess. So after over time, I peeled it out of the bottom of it and it just looks cool. So I'm gonna save that and use it in a mixed media piece. And it's like really rubbery, it's really weird. But I'm gonna save it for like a mixed media piece because I think it would be cool on something. I know, I'm weird, right? Dried paint. So I don't know. <laughs> so anyway, without any further ado, Let's see. The winners of the pairs of earrings are Aunt Bex Creations and Spanky Madison. So both of you lovely ladies each get a pair of my earrings that I made. So congratulations. Thanks for entering and thanks everybody who entered and left me a comment. I love it when you guys do that. Um, so I will send those out and um, I hope you guys will still check out my... Um, videos um i don't know i'm losing my train of thought because i'm seriously drugged up <laughs> i'm seriously drugged up so that my tooth won't hurt because yeah it hurts really bad um but i'm saying i'm a lot and i can't talk um so i guess i'm gonna end this video before it gets too disastrous i hope you guys have a great rest of your week and make sure you do what you love and love what you do and be nice to everybody i love you guys bye Mwah.